Say, what's up with uh, Helga lately, our uh, waitress from the future? I haven't seen her since she uh, shoved that salesman through the airlock without his spacesuit on. Oh, she was acquitted. Oh. Uh huh. The courts took pity on her because she's a refugee from the future. Oh. But actually, she's been very busy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's trying to incorporate election procedures from the future into our elections here at home. And uh, she's actually been very, no, she's been very successful. She got some people elected. Who, what? Yeah, who? Who she get elected? Jesse the Body Ventura. Well, uh, Helga got Jesse Ventura elected. That's right. Uh, uh, Zeke, uh, get her up here, okay? You get her. I'm, I'm afraid of her. Just be nice to her. Ask her to come up and talk with us. Say please. Well, last time I did that, she baked me a cake. She baked you a cake? Oh, how nice. No, she baked me in a cake, and it wasn't nice <laughs> at all. But I'll get her. I'll, I'll just tell her John wants to see her. She likes him. I don't think he likes her, though. Oh, sure he does. Mm -hmm. He just needs time. Hey, maybe we can get Helga to show us some of those future campaign methods. How's she going to do that? The magic of video. In the future, everything's video. Figures. You want to see my video of Great Debate? Sorry, it just takes a little getting used to. Uh, what debate? It is from the future for the presidency. I was not just a waitress in the future, you know. I was also political referee. Oh, you mean political moderator? No, referee. You see, roll tape. Let's take a look. See, I'm in charge. All right. Let's begin our debate by introducing our candidates. First, the great-grandson of President Bill Clinton and current President of the United States, the incumbent, Tommy Joe Clinton. Well, thank you, Ms. Helga. I'm here. I'm ready to party. And from the state of Minnesota, the great-grandson of Governor Jesse the Body Ventura, Governor Telly the Tubby Ventura. I'm here. I, I'm not running. Uh, well, I mean, I'm running for the presidency, but uh, I'm not running away from him. Come on, Chubbler. I'm ready. I'm waiting. No. First, the intellectual part of the debate. I have here the question. For you, Mr. President, what everyone wants to know, how many interns? All of them. Good answer. Now for you, Telly. Saddam Hussein, the new ruler of Iraq, comes to the Oval Office for peace talks. What do you do? I'll kick his behind. I'll, I'll, I'll gouge him in the eyeballs. I'll, I'll rip his insides out and have him for lunch. And that's before I shake his hand. Fine. Now, open round. First, you, Telly. I, I want to know why the president is such a Nancy boy. <laughs> I oh. bet he can't even bench a hundred pounds. Can't do, can't do. Cannot. No, you go no way. Can't do, can't do. Oh, I'm, I'm strong, and a wimpy guy like you do for the country. I can dance, me. Something a chunky boy like yourself ain't gonna do. It's been shown time and time again that the people want a sleazy sex machine for a president. However, the voters also want someone who is forceful. Oh, after I kick Hussein's butt, then I'm going to take those towel heads, and then I'm going to go ahead and kick their keisters, the guys in the black turbans, not the guys in the white turbans, because after all, those are the guys that sell us the oil. But after that, oh boy, watch out! Well, as you can see, quite a matchup. Will dancing Tommy Joe Clinton retain his crown? Hey! Or will Telly the Tubby Ventura body slam his way into the White House? We're taking the title, baby! This is our year! And that concludes our debate. Vote by sending in your money, as usual. And remember, it's not the politics, it's not the man, it's the image. Yeah!